Okay, here we go trying the ghost orchid multi catch. Um, right here with knocking good and uh, zero in. Dennis and Mario. We're here on the quest for Dennis to get his number 1000. Um, had a nice day at the Fakahashi Strand today. Little water on the trails. And we're about to jump in for stage one. I'm gonna show you a little bit of what this beautiful place is. Not your regular day catching. Alright, this oh. is uh, Snocking Good being covered by mosquitoes. You might not be able to see them, but you probably can hear them on my ear. Yeah, this is the issue about being in the swamps in Florida in the middle of May. Imagine June, and July, and August. <laughs> hey. It's all in good fun, right? Okay, finally. All right, we're here and on route to stage one of the Ghost Orchid Multi Catch. We're lucky enough today. There's hardly any water on the swamp, even though it has been raining for a while. Little bushwhacking required. Always uh, catching in this type of terrain requires a lot of concentration, um, checking everywhere. Our main concern is uh, water moccasin, especially the baby ones, which you pretty much find everywhere in this area of the swamp. They're well camouflaged with the surroundings, so something that there should be a concern. Everything else is just uh, just enjoying in nature. It's a beautiful, magical place, a very primitive, hardly touched by human hands. You can see uh, there goes Dennis and Mario navigating their way to uh, on route to stage one again. And we'll see you guys in a few. Alright, we finally found stage one of the, the Ghost Orchid Multi Catch. I have the other one. Yeah. Little bushwhacking required for this one. You know, the nice cypress trees growing off the ground in this area, popash trees. Catchers getting coordinates. Kiddos aren't fun today at all. Okay, we're here at stage two of uh the Ghost Orchid Multi Catch. There's Dennis getting ready to. Mind you, this is not the final, this is one of the stages. You saw it? Uh, yes, you could. He will give you directions to get another. Move on to stage three. Mosquitoes aren't fun at all today. Oh, I like that one. We have the panthers on it. Uh, 
and we'll see you guys uh, the next stage. Okay, we're here at stage uh, number three of the Ghost Orchid Multi Catch. Um, there comes Dennis and Mario again. We got uh, pretty much about 90% humidity today. Close mosquitoes. I mean, you gotta love geocaching to be in the middle of a swampy area in May looking for a catch. That is a five five star terrain. Five star difficulty, five star terrain. There we got the tag. Dennis is proceeding to get the tag. We'll see you guys at uh, stage four, hopefully in a few minutes, if we don't take that long. Okay, we're here to enjoy beautiful environment. Hopefully you're able to listen to the sounds that we got right now. You gotta go in the gate and pay the toll. <laughs> Everything native to this land, beautiful sounds. Leave them alone. <laughs> Whatever they are, leave them alone. I got enough with the mosquitoes today. We're back here bushwhacking on route to stage four. To go orchid. Oh, nice. Pack some for. <laughs> Pack some for lunch. Beautiful motions. All the wonders you can find here in the wild. This is the true Florida. For those of you that might be watching this up north, South Florida is not just sand and, and nice beaches. This is actually the true state of Florida. How it is and how it was before we came here. high humidity today not so bad we're actually having a pretty easy and nice hike compared to what this terrain should be and I'm gonna let you go guys here so I don't bore you you have a beautiful day today that's Mario saying bye Talk. see you in a few
marking the space. Okay, we're about 80 feet from stage number four of our journey here at the Ghost Orchid Multi Catch. I'm tell you, this catch is a five star terrain for a very good reason. Even though we have no water today, the heat and the humidity really gets you down. It slows you down a lot, but you're still able to enjoy the beautiful scenery that the catch has to offer. Mosquitoes have been with us the whole way. I already know where it is. I'm not going to say it. It is the one that took me an hour to find. And we're here searching for it. We'll see you guys as soon as we spot the stage number four. All right, we have spotted stage number four of the Ghost Orchid Multi-Catch. Not getting too close so we don't spoil the coordinates. <coughs> there is, Dennis is knocking good, uh, taking a picture to make sure that we got the correct coordinates in order to go forward to stage five. Taking a small break here. Mosquitoes aren't taking a break, We're getting eaten alive right now. This is pretty much the Fakahachi strand at its best. And we'll see you guys on route to stage five. Here we still are on route to stage five. As you can see, water is hardly present today. We're trying to use one of the ditches for the trams around us to make our trek a little easier on this part. Crazy. We've been here for a couple of hours. No, it's just uh, the heat. <laughs> Humidity and the heat aren't helping much. This little mosquito thing is not helping. I'll take that one or this one. This one looks like a This one looks. I don't know, it looks like a thing. We should have more to the right. Okay, that one. Trying to. Alright, now we got a little bushwhacking. There's a red eye As we go along, clouds of mosquitoes are flying by next to us.
people ask me why I do this, uh, I think we're crazy. I always said that to be a catcher you have to have a little crazy in you. That's one of the unofficial requirements. Take a break from the camera a little bit, so I'll see you guys uh, soon. There is a fungus among us. Here, stopping by to appreciate okay. another of the wonders of the strand. Okay, we just got one of the wonders of nature. I think Dennis was praying for rain. Finally, got it, we, we got some rain. We're all exhausted. We've been at it for like two hours and 50 minutes. Almost three hours so far. And at least nature is being kind and giving us some rain to cool down. Uh, this, this is what makes this place so wonderful. One minute we were cooking ourselves. Now we're really fresh. With a nice mild rain, which should hopefully stay that way for a couple of miles. Here we're on route to stage uh, five for the ghost orchid and I'm showing you in the camera why this catch is called the ghost orchid. That's one of the famous and rarest orchids in the whole planet. Sadly, we didn't get lucky enough to see a flower today. Do you have anything dry on you? But at least we get to see the plant. This is what a ghost orchid looks like. By now, we've been over three hours hiking in the middle of the fucking hat she just uh, looking for everything really tired it's mario dennis no move you dropped some i got some no you, there's no there's no dry place there's nothing dry mm -hmm. Okay, we continue our journey, uh, adventure of the Coast Orchid Multi-Catch. Here we got Mario and uh, Dennis searching for a stage five. Um, we here after <laughs> three plus hours of uh, bushwhacking and trekking to the swamp. But, all in good catching fun.
Ooh. It's a really nice area of the Fakahashi Strand. Still on route to finish the Ghost Orchid multi catch. Here we can see a, an orchid. That's a clamshell. No, it's not a clamshell. No? No. What is it? I think it's a, one of those Apenendrum nighttime Apenendrum. Night scented? Oh, no, Turlin? Yeah, no, Turlin. The night scented orchid. I think that's it. Alright, how are we looking? Definitely another can. Can't have long leaves. Still got rain cooling us down, which is awesome. We're navigating right now to the snow. Okay. Mario. And you're screwed. <laughs> and the wet season, all of this is about four or five feet of water. It's supposed to be on wet season. Okay, more like three to four feet of water. Judging by the water mark. You got more rain. You gotta love it cooling us down, keeping the mosquitoes away. Rain is the best thing that could happen to us today. It's not easy to trek around this area. Is a looking. Now what? Now why are you holding the GPS? <laughs> See, minor bushwhacking in ball. Dozer. <laughs> Ali, you can do it. Turn right. Come back over here. And here we got one of the dangers of the Fakahachi. Beautiful snake looking at us like we almost stepped on it. We almost stepped on it. Uh, she's pretty much looking at us saying, uh, You better go. Another reason why this catch is a five star terrain. This type of snake only gives you 45 minutes to get to the hospital before you're really, really in trouble. And at the moment I think I'm getting too close to it, so let me just back up a little. It does not look too happy to see us. Open its mouth? Yeah. Okay. yeah, and it's moving away. It decided to let us go, so we're gonna do the same. Wait a minute, there's a, there's a bigger one there. Oh, I see there's it. A bigger one. There is two of them in there. Where's the other? Oh, yeah. oh, great. Okay, I think uh, two is enough for me. <laughs> so, you gonna. Alright, we have finally arrived to a stage number six of the Ghost Orchid. I'm gonna let the guys uh, enjoy the search while the mosquitoes are still eating us alive. But we're having a nice refreshing rain. And we're a little bit more calm after finding the two water moccasins that we almost stepped on. Like I said, it's just part of the beauty of this place. I'll leave you a few minutes to enjoy the sounds of the rain and the local birds.
finally got this thing. Okay, now this, more. Is, this is one more to the final. One more. That back there is not the owl, by the way. It's just Mario dying on us. <laughs> Great job. Awesome paint job. Well, I'm um, not going to make it easy for anybody coming after us to find it, so I'm going to stop here and I'll meet you guys at the final, so you don't see the secret of the owl. Okay, we're heading out to the final of the Ghost Orchid Multicatch. Uh, it's been a long day. We've been out here for about five hours by now. Yes, we have a nice cypress forest we're going through keeping an eye out for snakes since the rain is off it was over now they're popping out more often than what we would like to but it's still a nice hike on a beautiful beautiful forest Here's the road. Yeah, it's a chopper. Do you hit your thing from the stick? Finally. Made one, 1,000 fine. It goes working. It's definitely a 5.5. Five. Well worth it. You gotta do it. All right, we finally made it to the final of the Ghost Orchid. Dead tire. Yes, sir. Five plus hours, and we still got a good mile to get out of here. Ah, definitely a catch that you really wanna do, and you don't wanna do it alone. Bring a spendable hiking companion, as I always say for this kind of tracks into the middle of the Fakahachi. Now he's uh, doing the owners of signing his number 1000. Well worth the catch of the 1000. And I hope you guys like the video. Not the best one ever, but at least we took it to a spot where you don't go every single day. So signing out. Take care. Thank you. 